The Scorpion's Tail by Gerald Durrell. The, this excerpt has been taken from the famous book of the author, My Family and Other Animals. This chapter is originally named The World in a Wall. The World in a Wall is a story about a boy who finds a wall near his home. He carefully observes the wall and sees many living creatures living on it, varying from geckos to crane flies. They were divided into day and night workers, the hunters and the hunted. Suddenly, the author observed a very deadly animal, the scorpion. Gerald Durrell found scorpion quite charming. He often ripped away sections of plaster of the garden wall to observe them. By crouching under the wall at night, he caught glimpses of their courtship dances. One day, author found a fat female scorpion in the wall, wearing what first appeared to be a fawn fur coat, which actually turned out to be a mass of tiny babies clinging to their mothers. Darrell decided to smuggle them into his house so that he could watch the babies grow up. He quickly kept the mother and its babies into a matchbox and carried them inside the house. He kept the matchbox on the mantelpiece. Larry, having finished his lunch, proceeded to light a cigarette and unfortunately picked up the same matchbox. As soon as he opened it, the scorpion mother, probably being annoyed at being shut in the matchbox for so long, seized the first opportunity to escape. Larry, feeling the movement of a claws, glanced it to see it was and from that moment, things got increasingly confused. Larry screams, scattering babies everywhere, and flings the scorpion onto the table. He uttered a roar of fright, scattering babies everywhere. And as it landed there, the babies scattered like the confetti on the table. He uttered a roar of fright, which made Lugrezia drop a and brought Roger out from beneath the table, barking loudly. The creature leapt towards Lissel, who leapt to his feet, overturning his chair, and flicked out desperately, sending Scorpion rolling across the clothes towards Margaret. She let out a scream that any railway engine would have proud to produce, and hurled a glass of water at it. The shower missed the Scorpion, but drenched Arthur's mother who sat gasping at the end of the table. Roger, mystified by the panic, under the mistaken impression that the family was attacked, thought it was his responsibility to defend. As Lugrezia was the only stranger in the room, Roger bit her on the ankle. It only made matters worse. After a while, a certain amount of order was restored, and the family retired to the drawing room. Darrell spent half an hour going around picking up the scorpion's baby with the teaspoon and returned them on their mother's. He carried the scorpion family outside and very reluctantly released them on the garden. 